Imagine you're standing outside St. Petrock's Church. The roadworks are finished, the sun is shining, the trees are in bloom, and the traffic and people are moving smoothly. You walk up to Mount Folly, and there, in the heart of Bodmin, is the public rooms. The stained glass windows have been restored and reflect the sun. You go in through the main entrance to a bustling front of house area. There's a cafe, and on the table, a group of young mothers and their babies. Another table, there's a book group, and in the corner, a young girl practices the piano. You make your way to the box office and pick up a brochure. The afternoon, you could join a Pilates class or attend the French speaking class in the cafe. In the evening, you have a choice too. There's an open mic in the drill hall or an Oscar winning film in the auditorium. Tomorrow sees the start of the public rooms' two week run of The Importance of Being Earnest and the beginning of a new set of Zumba classes. You decide to watch the film. But in the meantime, you can nip across the road to see the courtroom experience before grabbing a bite to eat at the new cafe that's opened on Honey Street. A space that embodies inspiration, opportunity and creativity in what it stands for and what it aspires to be. A space that is state of the art in its design and functionality. A space is accessible for those limited mobility and for those who never engage in the arts. For the young, for the old, for the creatively curious and the creatively challenged. The public rooms is more than just a building, it's an emblem. An emblem of what Bobman is and what Bobman could be.